Yeah, Kilimanjaro, I got sick because I got sick before I went up the mountain. I, I had food poisoning and then I started hiking up and I had no chance and I got high altitude bomber in Ima, which I didn't know at the time. And they took me off the mountain and the next morning when the, the doctor saw me, he says, oh, you'll be fine, but uh, you know, you could have died up there if you stayed overnight. So I was happy that I got off the mountain when I got off the mountain. Then I'm in the hospital uh, on oxygen and uh, diabetics and I'm watching CNN and on the bottom, the, the, the ticker, you know, it says Martina Navratilova quits her attempt to climb Kilimanjaro. I'm like, quit? I quit? Okay, I could have stayed up there and died or I quit. <laughs> So if you want to put it that way, I quit, but uh, I was taken off on a stretcher on one of those uh, toboggans with a wheel underneath it. it. Took about five hours to get to the bottom. Anyway, all is good. But about half the people made it up to the top, but we had really, really lousy weather. On the third day, it was snowing. It wasn't supposed to snow until the last day. So we battled the elements and, and I battled an upset stomach and, and the stomach won.